Howdy folks, back again with some special news for y'all today. As y'all probably know, it's June 11th. Y'all know what day this is, right? It has officially been 30 years since one of Steven Spielberg's most famous blockbusters hit the theaters for the whole dinosaur-loving world to enjoy. Yes sirree Bob, whether it went by slower than molasses or faster than a bullet for you, it has officially been three decades since the beauty, wonder, terror, and danger of dinosaurs captured the imaginations of the entire planet by folks young and old alike in the film Jurassic Park. Ellie Sadler, played by Laura Dern, Alan Grant, played by Sam Neill, and of course, Ian Malcolm, played by y'all lady's favorite boyfriend, Jeff Goldblum, are chosen to tour a theme park on the island of Isla Nublar, which is the home of dinosaurs created from prehistoric DNA. Now everything seems safe and squared away with the owner of this here rig, John Hammond, played by Richard Attenborough, assuring them so. But all hell later breaks loose when a greedy fat man, Dennis Nedry, played by Wayne Knight, starts snatching embryos and turning off the park's power, causing the ferocious dinosaurs to bust out of their paddocks. Yeah, ooh, ah, that's how it always starts. But then later there's running and, and screaming. Whether your favorite dinosaur was the beautiful Brachiosaurus, the pretty Parasaurolophus, the galloping Gallimimus, the deadly Dilophosaurus, the tough Triceratops, the terrifying Tyrannosaurus Rex, or the vicious Velociraptors, Jurassic Park had just about every kind of critter you can imagine. Steven Spielberg and the boys from Stan Winston Studios used a combination of animatronics, CGI, and practical effects to bring 1993's number one movie into its full glory. And even 30 years later, the effects are still convincingly lifelike. The dinosaurs they brought back from extinction are still absolutely gorgeous. Or still absolutely terrifying. The Michael Crichton story had a budget of 63 million USD and even won over 20 awards such as the Academy Award for Best Visual Effects and another for Best Sound Mixing. Jurassic Park also became the oldest film in history to surpass a billion bucks in ticket sales in the 17th overall. This prehistoric tale also later became a franchise with five other films following after it. Some say the sequels came in close behind the 93 classic. Some might even say one of them is their favorite whether they flew far or flopped. Others might say that all the other films should be completely ignored, but one thing can be made certain. None of it would have been possible without the hard work of Steven and the boys to make Jurassic Park what it is today, 30 years later. It was quite an adventure, an adventure 65 million years in the making.